Hey, what's up gamers, and welcome to the next exciting episode of Lake Erie, Ohio. Our current infected free zone playthrough. Picking up right where we left off. We had three incoming hordes coming through these buildings. We went ahead and took them out, like the awesome sauce that we are. Um, some of them did retreat back, we went ahead and cleared that out as well. We're now going to be deconstructing this building, because it's going to give us, as you can see, lots of resources. We need those resources oh so badly. We got this wall, we just need to wrap it around this back side, put in some more guard towers, and then we should be good on that front, at least for a while. The big thing right now, though, is weapons. We need weapons. One more research point, and then we can start researching our own guns. However, I did a little map scouting and found that off of this way, so there's this big giant building, but right here, a little, little badge. We're going to send the crew in, clear it out, hopefully get some guns, maybe some assault rifles. And then we've got a couple more down here as well. So, curious to see what these buildings are in real life. Uh, it says apartments, so it thinks that those are armed apartments. Uniformed service facility, but it's listed as apartments. Same thing here, listed as apartments, apartments, apartments. That's hilarious. But they're apartments, but they're listed as uniform service facility. So who knows? I'd be curious to check Google Maps and see what they actually are. But we are in February, but everyone knows February in Ohio means frozen. All right, so they're going to go ahead and take care of that. We got to get one more field complete to knock this off, and then we got to build the cookhouse, which that's going right here. But I have building on hold because we need to scavenge as many of these resources as we can. That is kind of the priority right now. We've got a good little wall off zone, so infected do come, they're gonna wanna naturally kinda come around. Once we do wall this off though, they'll hit for weak points. So you'll find that there'll be like a certain segment of wall that's just slowly going down, going down. The next wave will wanna hit it again and again. But as long as we have enough towers that cover each other like this with all this overlap, and then if they're all armed towers on top of that, I think we should be fine. We should be okay. Uh, one cool thing that I did notice is each of these survivors has a name and a background. And, like, you can click on each of them. Let me grab that one. Oh, well. It won't let me right now. I don't know why. I did it earlier. I was able to click on some of them, and it gave me, like, a full little background. I thought that was really cool that, like, they each have a thing. Because then you can click on them here and, you know, see what's up. Alright, so we got the AK squad, which is squad 2. So squad 2 is almost done. Squad 1 is over at the research building. Or sorry, the, uh, the cop building. Okay, where research is up. So now we can start researching pistol production. All the more reason to dismantle this building... Because we're going to need that metal. We're going to need all that metal so we can start cranking out guns. Start cranking out guns, baby. Alright, so we're almost a third of the way through. Let's go out here and see what they got for us. Oh, okay, eight things of ammo. We got a whole bunch of ammo. Nine more things of ammo. Alright, so this is looking fruitful in the ammo department. Building clear. Alright. Night is falling. Everybody's going inside. So we're going to max out the guards now. We're running out of resources. We're out of pistols. I know. I know. They're going to load this up as best they can. On my way. Going there. Let's do it. And they're going to come back. passed through here recently but what's more curious one of the vehicles must have had tracks instead of tires maybe hmm. some kind of bulldozer or a tank maybe a tank roger that be careful a tank would be cool right. Receiving. did they not find Let's anything that is unfortunate my way. this building had nothing to offer that sucks. Reporting. 
Let's make sure they're all locked and loaded. Let's do it. Then we'll send them over here. We'll get the other crew in here. Then we can start moving them over. Yep. But researching that gun factory is literally going to be what makes or breaks us. Receiving. All right, let's have you guys go over here. Move. And then let's speed ourselves through the night. Hopefully we don't get any action. I'm really hoping not. It's going to be a long night. All's quiet. Knock on wood. It stays that way. Oop, I hear those cries. Alright, there's an arrow right here. I want to know what this arrow is pointing to. Let's check that out real quick. What is this arrow on the right pointing to? Okay, it wants us to go and discover the next zone. Oh yeah, send your squad on an expedition. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's not going to happen. Sorry guys. At least not immediately. We need to worry about getting all of these watchtowers properly armed. We're running out of resources. Okay. So now it is daytime. Cloud cover, but it's not a storm. So it's a good thing. Let's clear everybody out. We'll max out scavengers again. We're going to need materials. Alright, now let's get these crews Reporting. locked and loaded. Roger. Roger. Now that we have a destination to hopefully look for more weapons and ammo. On my way. Um, okay. On my way. Uh, on my way. What the hell are you guys doing? We're on the move. Roger. On my way. On my way. Let's do it. Ready for action. Here, get in the car. On my way. Roger. Waiting orders. That was weird. Yeah, that was really weird. I do not know what happened there. Alright, so we have the one crew needs to come and finish. Going there. So it's squad two. We grab squad one. Have them come start on the next building. Roger. But yeah, we got this one, then we got three more right here. Hopefully we can get some more guns. Hopefully. This one should be... So we're looking... Okay, we're almost about 50% on the gun factory side of things. That is good. That is good. Ooh, we got a good bit of brick. Might want to start thinking about finishing this off. I don't know, though. I don't know. You know what? It's early enough in the day. I'm going to go ahead and max out our builders. Let's start cranking these things out. Get these towers up. More people on watch. Hopefully we'll get some more guns coming in. I mean, one way in, one way out. I'm, I'm, fingers crossed. I'm hoping that's, that's going to do us a benefit. I've tried bases and playthroughs where I've put one at each of the four sides and it always ends up creating chaos. I find that the infected try to localize to the door. Uh, Charles Carter. Yep, all kinds of good homies here. Justin, Charles, Adam, Ted Gordon, Keith, Terry. Construction There's nothing to eat. Oh, we got somebody died of hunger. All right, that's no bueno. That is no bueno. We have tons of food stuff down here. We we got we got caught lacking. There's a truck. That is way better. Reporting. Let's do it. Oh yeah, come down here and get the truck. Should right. no, just come right here. I'm like right there. We can get out. We can do Let's this. Do this car can be abandoned. Okay, they got a pistol. Research complete. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So we can start making pistols. Oh, we gotta build a factory. 
Should have plenty of materials now. Alright, we got the truck. Let's get over here and start getting food. Where are all those little tic-tac buildings? Yep, get over here. Go over here and start getting food. We're on the move. And then these guys. Waiting orders. I'm gonna have them get into this car. So it should have. Yep, it's got the two ammo. That one's empty. Receiving. There's nothing left. On my way. Roger. Alright, and then they're gonna head back with their new pistol and tons of ammo. Then we got this car that we're leaving behind. But that truck is way better. It's gonna hold so much more. Look at that, it's got a whole nother row. But man, food, 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 food. We got six, but we need this cookhouse so we can start converting it into cooked meals. That's a huge, huge deal. Huge, huge deal. All right, let's look at what the factory, arms factory, what is that going to cost us? All right, eight workers, ten workers, eight workers. I guess we'll go with this one, or what if we do this one? Eleven workers. Ooh. Make this the pistol factory. Yeah, we'll do that. We need that pronto dente. Pronto dente. We are out of resources. We're out of basic tools. That's what we need to make the factory. Alright, what about the tool factory itself? Okay, nine, twelve, ten. Let's go there. Do the same thing. Oop. Time to sleep, everyone. Okay, Tomorrow so we're gonna throw everything out. Max out the guards. We're missing resources. Let's get these guys or gals down here. Operator, let's do it. Oh, get in the car. There we go. There. I'm going to have them kind of go through the night. Looks like we're getting some snow. We're going to need this food. No more to find. No, Let's do this it. one. I don't know why they moved the truck around. That was kind of dumb. Clear. Got a lot of food. Yeah, a lot of food. So hopefully, it should do us some good. What is this? Abandon. Go ahead and deconstruct that. It's kind of weird, but okay. Infected incoming. Ooh, okay, there they are. We finally get a little bit of action. I was hoping to keep it nice and quiet, you know? Like, can we get one episode where it just chills? Oh man, they're coming in deep. They are rolling deep. Let's get over here. They're coming from this side. You know, it's a good thing we've had a spotter out here, honestly. Yeah, and this is essentially gone, so they can just come right on through. Waiting orders. We're on the we'll move. Come in here. Another one incoming. Need these guys to finish up real quick. Operator. Wait, come on, come on, come on, come on, finish up, guys. Get up over here. Yeah. Oh, they're going to get him with the vehicle? Oh, this is going to be glorious. They're doing a good job so far. Roger. The infected are pillaging a building. Oh, get up here. No, why? Why? 
Like, why would you? On my way. Let's do it. And there we go. We got a whole bunch of food. Ooh, thank goodness. All right, so a little bit of health taken here. Most of these look okay. Let's see a little bit of health in the front gate. All right, all in all, not too bad though. I'm still still pleased. We're just gonna need to get these crews back out there and hit up those gun locations here real real quick. We are out of resources. Yes, out of pistolas. I know, I know, I know. Get up, everyone. All right, it's a nice sunny day. Zero out everybody here, max out here, and then go there. We're running out of stock. We're out of basic tools, I know. But we hey, we got some food. Let's put you guys in that, you guys in there. We're on the move. Let's do it. We're on the move. They're trying that Operator. stupid thing again where they were gonna go. <laughs> that weird building glitch that we saw earlier. Alright, there's broke ass car. Where is it? Ah, here we go. Alright, truck guys are gonna come here. And then let's grab the car guys and have them come here. Yeah. Yeah. We'll hit up for some... We got, we got a little bit of food. Ooh, building adapted. Approaching! Sir, we've spotted some people. They're probably armed. Approach them friendly. Reporting. Let's do it. Going there. Going there. We're on the move. Um, can we do anything? On my way. We're under attack. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, we treated them as friendly. And they started opening fire at us. Uh, my oi. This stuff will never stop. Let's do it. Just get out of there, guys. Get out of there. Let's drive off. Alright, so now we know we got a, a little raider group wandering around just outside our village. Or just outside the safe zone. That's no bueno. Oh, we got a cookhouse. That's good. Once we get the barn, we'll start generating meat. So that'll help. Yeah, but we gotta find, like, animals or something out in the wild. That's the only way that we'll be able to do that. Warehouse-wise... Could be doing better. Building-wise, let's see, 27, 26, 14... Ooh, okay, yeah, we're gonna need another house. So, shelter... Yep, let's convert that one. Might as well, then they're all right here. Alright, we got a good bit of farming coming in. Our scientists are maxed out, farming's maxed out, food prep's maxed out. Okay, good, good, good. we we'll max out our builders. Get that finished off. It's 11 o'clock. You know what, let's start the brick wall. Alright, let's start it like that and then we'll take it over to like maybe here and then from there we'll go straight back like this and from there we'll take it a little schmidge like that and then we'll try and carry it through a little bit more to like here and then hopefully from there, straight on. Okay. Yep, sweet. And then that will be our infection-free zone. And the other thing, so here, let's get everybody on building. Just get out there and build. All right, we got plenty of materials to get us through right now. We're running out of stock. Running out of bags of grain. We're, uh, we're doing our best. We're doing our best. Got canned foods, hopefully, to stretch us if we need to. Right. Building clear. 
wooden tower. Right. Going there. Going there. We're on the move. We'll Let's do it. Tweak it. Roger. On my way. We we'll go here. Roger. What the hell is going on over there? You guys are hearing that, right? The Roger, 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 Roger. Like, what are they doing? Okay, we're gonna need to put one like here. Raiders are coming. Get ready. Raiders are coming. They're right there. There's like four of them. Like, <laughs> cool the beans. As they, as they say, right? Right there. I need another one in right here. And then we'll put in another one. Literally right next to it there. So some areas are a little bit more doubled. That's going to give us some good coverage, though. Good coverage. Okay. So we're going to need to max that out. Yes, we're missing pistolas. And then where's the other squad? What squad one is here? Ready for action. Where is squad two? Okay. Let's do it. We never had them. Oh, you know, let's have them come grab this pistol. Yeah, I totally forgot that they were just going for one piece of ammo. They were literally just sitting out there the whole day. We're on the move. That was a super waste of firepower. I got two guns. Or do we want to risk? Going there. You know what? We'll risk it. We will risk having them scavenge through the night. This could be a good risk. This could be a bad risk. We'll find out. We shall find out. Ooh, three AKs and a pistol? Oh. There's nothing left. Oh, hell yeah. Ah, ah. Going too fast. Okay, yeah, they need to come back right now. But all them goodies. Here, let's go home. Yeah, they need to get back here. Pronto Dente. Ooh, these ones over Roger. here. Oh, yeah. And then we put the AKs into the hands of the ground teams. And then more, that means just more pistols for our people. Good, 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 good. Happy day. So actually, let, let me see. Oh, tech dogs. Operator. Let's see if I can do it on here. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we'll grab this. We'll go boop. Boop. And boop. There we go. Look at that. Yeah. Hell yeah. Locked and loaded. They all got AKs. I'm assuming. That's what the picture looks like. It looks like a little AK. AK something. You know, 47, maybe 74. I don't know. Who, who knows? I just, you know, that's a little generic symbol for AK in my mind. You know, even when I play like Rust and stuff, you know, that's, they call them AKs. And that's totally what they look like. We went up on pistols. Oh yeah, look at that. Bleep, 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 bleep. Everybody got pistols. So we got good pistol coverage now. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, that makes me happy. That makes me happy. Then we're gonna start cranking them out. It's gonna be uh, a true American <laughs> refuge. We're gonna have two guns for every people. Right? You got two hands, you got two guns. That's how we're gonna do it. That's how we do it in my America. Get up and earn your keep. Amen, sister. Alright, we're maxing out builders. We are out of resources. Alright, so food prep. How are we doing here? Two grain. We have no grain. Alright, so let's take out food prep. Throw you guys into here for now. Scientist always, farming always. Alright, AK crew, we're gonna give you the truck. And then we got the handgun crew. Alright, they got that thing loaded up with fuel. So let's send them back out. 
We gotta find that super awesome little area. See, it's above this. Uh, right here. So send the AK crew there. And then now they're in a car. Wait for it to fuel up. We're gonna send them for some food. We're gonna do a little grocery store run. Start hitting up all the places back down here. Oh, yeah, same little crew of douchebags. Alright, let's get you guys down here. Hostile group incoming. Port spotted. Shoot at him. Pop, 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 pop. Drive by. Chief, we're under attack. I've been looking around more recently. And I'm thinking everything's turning green. Pure. We're not the masters of this world anymore. Hell no. Yep. What do you mean by that? Branches sticking out of windows and roots breaking through, as if the forest itself has come to reclaim the land. That's awesome. All these animals around downtown, it's their world now. And the infected. We will reclaim it. Right? We're the dominant species. We're going to get back into things. All right, well, they had four. Now they're just down to three. I feel like every time we drive by, we, dr we take one of them out. <laughs> one of these nights, though, they're going to get hit by the infected. Just watch. There are farmers and scientists still cranking through. All right, what are we going to do next? We can always go with assault rifles. That's going to take ten, though. Construction, we go with advance. That takes eight. Food, fertilization, preservation. Chemistry. Basic knowledge of chemical reactions and their use. It opens the way to the development of other production technologies. So fertilizer, fuel, and then I'm assuming what will eventually lead into making ammo. Weather forecast med... Ooh, medical care. Yeah, let's do that next. So let's go ahead and start that research. Right, meow. We're missing resources. We're out of wood. The hell are we out of wood? Huh. Okay. Ooh, some of these people are hurt. Alright, on to the next. Roger. Reporting. On my way. Alright, so it's squad one. You up to squad two. Waiting orders. Fifty two percent. Adaptation complete. Ooh, building adapted. That's what I like to see. Let's start making tools. Wooden metal to make tools. We got any wood left here? Oh yeah, we got a lot of we got a, over a hundred wood. Just under a hundred wood. Right there, yeah. So once we get in, get back into breaking these down, we'll be fine. I really thought we had more. I think it's just because I saw the the really high brick number and just got super excited for the wall, not realizing that uh, we also kind of need wood. <laughs> this is a good little zone, though, right here. So medical center is going to be another big one that we're going to need to unlock here. Once we upgrade, and then the barn, and the cannery, it looks like. Chemical plants. Yeah, med bay. Alright, what was clear? I missed that. Squad one. Reporting. We're on the move. Roger. Hope you guys are still scavenging. It's not squad one. Ah, squad two. We've got a butt ton of ammo. Alright, so no pistolas. No AKs. Nothing good like that. All oh, these little tiny knickknack buildings. Oh, there's another truck right here. It's definitely worth going and getting. Alright, let's have him hit up all these little fuel buildings. I want to know this. Look at like this is a giant. It's registering as one. 
I'm thinking this is probably like a hospital in real life. That is just massive. That's probably got to be at least a day or two's worth of scavenging. Like, that's just insane to me. Alright, so we're going to cover them. Just have them keep going down the line. There's nothing left. And I only got two little things of fuel. Alright, where's my other crew? There's those guys. Ooh, group of survivors. We might... See, they got the middle of the little machete symbol, so... We're gonna have Operate. these guys intercept. Could use the additional peoples. Left. Let's Roger. get up here. Search done. Let's do it. Oh, we got incoming. Sir, we've encountered a group of people willing to join us. All right. Yeah, come on Send in. Send them in. Reporting. We're on the move. Oh. Help if I press play. Ooh, that's going to be bad news. We're on the move. Hopefully they don't get hit by the raiders. We're on the move. Looks like they're making a nice little building dash yeah all right research complete nice we're gonna have medical care they might get caught in the open though here they gotta get gotta book it come on guys you gotta book it let's go ahead and take these fools out no Roger Run him over. Run him over. Running out of resources. Requesting support. Oh, take him out. We'll drive by action. Come on. Going there. Roger. Going there. Oh, we got a pistol. Come on, take him out. Take him out. Roger. We're on the move. Hell yeah. Are we full? Yeah, we're full. All right, let's get back in. Roger. All right, and it is nighttime, so we need to get everybody out on guard duty. We need factory workers ASAP. And then everyone else, we're gonna put a scavenger for tomorrow. All right now, where's the other crew? Who is this? Reporting. This is squad one. Okay. Squad two. Reporting. It's just right here. Alright. How much fuel do they got? Oh, snap! Search done. It's the last little buildings. They got a lot of fuel, though. Let well, them come down here and pick up these guns and ammo. We're gonna have great coverage. We're gonna need to get this last house built up. Everyone will go out and scavenge. We'll get the rest of the wood we need. Should be good to go going forward. Pretty much just waiting on these Ready guys. No more to find. We're running out of resources. Yes, I, I know how the whole resource thing works. I get it, I get it, I get it. I'll let them do their thing. They'll go back, get the rest of that fuel, and then we'll have them come get the guns and ammo. It'll be a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Receiving. Look at all that. Oh, yeah. Imagine a well placed shot on that truck. That thing is going boom. It's going kaboom. Receiving. Let's do it. Come get these guns. Come get these guns. I do find it hilarious that they prefer the roads. Like they'll take the road around. Because, you know, shortest distance would be just to cut through like that. Grab these pistols and ammo. And grab this ammo. Yep, and then get back up here. We'll get these guys to come over here. Let's we'll see where... They were driving over here when they said something. So let's see, where is it coming from? We got every tower with pistols now. We have more. Yeah, we even have extra guns. 
Like, we're doing great. So I'm not worried about our ability to defend ourselves right now. I'm actually feeling a little bit more confident. Now the question is, where are they going to come from? Just going to keep a watchful eye. I'm hoping we'll get to the point where we can just straight up daisy it. You know, and just take a full-on onslaught. Alright, let's get everybody off of guard duty. Max out onto scavenge duty. That's what we need right now. Alright, let's get you guys in your truck. You guys over in your car. We're making good progress. Made it 15 days. Sir, the people have reported hearing a lot of noises coming from underground. They're afraid Ugh. that it could be infected moving through the sewers and tunnels. I believe we it. We need to bolster our defenses and be ready to attack from within, too. Amen, sister. We'll be ready. All right. Operator. Car squad. Mm, you guys come hit this up. Truck squad. Come do this one. And then hit this one. Then come hit this one. Try to find any last little like tic tac buildings, little tiny ones that'll be quick and easy. Yeah, and then I guess we'll just go from there. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. Let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. All right, sending the crews out. We got people working, making tools. Oop, wrong button. We got. Max farmers, max scientists, max workers for tools. How are we doing food wise? All right, so we can actually. I mean, we got a wow, we got a good little supply chain though. Going there. Getting this broken down very very quickly. It's the wood aspect though that's kind of killing us. I would say we'd start getting into food prep, but we got a little bit of canned food left. We'll let the grain kind of pile up before we start eating into that. Huh, <laughs> pun intended. All in all, we're holding out. We're doing great. Alright, so med. Allows drug production, shortening recovery time for the wounded. Citizens treat themselves more effect efficiently. Sorry, not effectively. Weather forecasting, chemicals, arm production, construction, advanced wood. So I'm thinking advanced woodwork is going to be the next one. So we can up the shelters into houses. You know, hold more people, make it more comfortable, and they'll actually get a buff to their morale. So I think that'll be the next one we'll shoot for. And then we'll go for fertilization after that. Here, let's speed shit up. Building clear. Oh, they found a good bit of food. Alright, sweet. And they'll come down here and hit that one. They got some food and ammo in here, it looks like. How are they doing? About 50%. This building should almost be done. Yeah, about almost 80%. That little conga line of people. Alright, calm down, Sharon. Jeez Louise, Papa Cheese. No more to find. Let's do it. Right, they're gonna load up all these. We're on the move. On my way. Got one more gun there. All right, so we got a good bit of guns. Waiting orders. Let's bring them back too. Roger. Get all that food that these starving people so desperately need. It is about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Alright, we'll have them... So we'll put the Pistola crew in here. But for the most part, we're going to have everybody chill for the rest of the day. It's a nice sunny day. If we have a clear night, I'll immediately send them right back out. But we'll use these last few hours of daylight to allow them to relax. Look at that, we got food back up and going. Waiting orders. They got plenty of ammo. We'll Let's send them over it. here. 
So all the rest of these should be good. It's just this last little side that we're going to need to finish off. Ooh, so close here. And once this is fully scavenged, we should be good to start construction again. Work's done. Head back to your shelters. All right, head back to your shelters. No, no, no. Get your booties on guard duty. <laughs> guard duty booty. <laughs> Guns and get out, out there. We're running out of stock. How do we go from having enough guns to then now not having enough? I'm confused by this. I'm confused by this. This does not make sense. Oh, it is a clear night. Okay. So, like I said, we'll send them right back out. But with every good clear night, comes a really bad day. So, we gotta brace for that in our future. Oh, come on, y'all. Get into your damn cars. Alright, let's start looking this way. What do we got over here? Just an endless line of houses. Yep, endless line of houses. So, start hitting them up. Let's do it. There. So let's get them going. Waiting orders. Let them come and get let's that last it. gun. So we got that last gun. Let's send them over here for some medical. See what this is all about. There's nothing left. Right, so there's nothing. I got some food. Chief, we found some medical supplies. Sweet. They'll definitely come in handy. Now we'll be able to give first aid to the Search wounded. Done. But if we want to heal people more efficiently, we'll need to build a med bay. Roger that. The med bay sounds like a good idea. We'll think of that. Let's see, med bay. There's nothing left. One staff member. Morning, everybody. Time to earn your living. Did it back here. A little med bay in the back. Four unit. It only has one unit. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just have to make that to med bay, and we'll just have a single doctor on staff. All right, no more guards. Maxing out builders. We're missing resources. Need to get everything built up. All right, let's get these guys. You know what? Let's do the same thing. Set up all the little tic tac buildings. Oh, don't want to go too fast. All right, these guys are done. Let's bring them back in. Yeah, we're just clearing out. See these little houses? They do them so much quicker because they're used to having to do these big-ass buildings. They go in and clear these houses out hell of quick. It makes me happy. No more to find. Uh, Operator. We're we'll gonna come back way. over here. We might come and do these two. And then you can come start on this chain. That should be a good bit for them. There's nothing left. It's only 9 a.m. Clear. There's nothing left. Building construction. Oh, all right, there you go. Boom, 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 boom. Walls are going up like mad right now. Building work done. Boom, Building boom, 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 boom. Construction building complete. There you go. We're Tow running out of resources. Towers are going up like crazy. Building is good. So there should be nobody there. 
Got a good bit in here, good bit there. Okay, yeah. Sweet. Definitely makes me happy. I'm right, gonna get all of them back out to building. Start scavenging. Building is going down. We got workers breaking out tools. We're maxed out. Okay, so now we're gonna have to grab all of these people. Lock and load, get up on those towers. Let's grab everybody. All hands on deck, y'all. Let's get everybody in. We're on the boat. And then send everybody out. That can go out. We have the wall sealed. There's only the one tower right here. That's missing. We had a whole bunch of guns. I'm hoping the people with guns are the ones going to the wall. And that we don't have a certain amount of guns being left behind. Got some cooked meals, that's good. We're producing a good bit of grain, it looks like. Looks like they got the car. They're hitting up those. Where's the other crew? Oh, they're here. What do you got? Oh, they got a gun. Right, let's get them back in. Oh, snap. Alright, yeah, they need to get in quick. Yes, I can see that. Doing a good bit of damage. Come on now, y'all. Come on now. Receiving. Let's do it. I want you guys over there. Let's do it. Look, yeah, we're definitely gonna need help over here. They're trying to get inside. Here we go. Pop off some more shots. They're trying to get inside. Once the AKs get up in there, though, they're just going to be a whole on war zone. There they go, popping off. Pop, 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 pop. We're so close right here. One more tool is what stands between us and being able to start making more pistols. Start being repaired. Let's see this one. Yep, Check the one next to it. Oh heck yeah, this one is good. We might as well do that one. Okay, what about this corner piece? Nope. Okay, and the one around the curve. Nope. Okay. So hopefully here we should be good. Surprises. We're running out of resources. Yes, we're out of pistols, as always. Alright, well, I'm gonna continue holding us down through the night, but I think it's a good spot as any to go ahead and call it for this episode. Looks like on average I'm doing about five to six days per episode. So here we are on day 17. But as always, guys, thank you so much for stopping by and joining me on yet another amazing journey in the infection-free zone here in Lake Erie, Ohio. If you haven't already, please hit that like button, drop me a comment, let me know how I'm doing, how I'm not doing. And if you haven't already, smash that subscribe. Join the ever-growing community here at the Bears and Beans channel. And if you'd like to further stay in the know, you can head over to Instagram and follow me at Bears and Beans Gaming. I follow all gamers back. And for additional support, you can become a member over at Patreon. Link in the description on for that. You'll get access to all kinds of behind-the-scenes footage as well as unedited content. And now, going forward, all the videos you will get 24 hours in advance. So that is super awesome. Definitely go check that out if you get a chance. Another big announcement, look forward to Saturday's live stream. I'll be giving away some Steam keys. So I hope to see you all there. But as always, guys, thank you so much for stopping by. You're an amazing, wonderful community. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one.